Hello everybody, it's me, Zachary. I am here to te- Sorry it's like so dark in here. Like it's just, it's like this light bulb's out. So like, so dark in here. Alright, that might be better. A lot of people want to know how I wireless bridge. So I'm going to show them that. I got a net gear router out there in the living room or out there in the kitchen. Okay. Now a lot of people say, Zachary, I I'm not gonna do wireless bridge, and so I put them on the same channel. And then is what happens is you go into your tablet, you say it says fail to obtain an IP address because this mo this um modem is wireless. So I disabled the wireless capability for this one. And so basically this is our router for back here. And then that's our um, router that this one shares. And you don't obviously want to run Ethernet cable, Ethernet cables. So this is what I'm going to show you guys how to do. It's the router box. But this, how I'm going to show you guys how to do this is it's so simple. The this router, you either got to change one router. This has does not have a MAC address. The IP is 192.168.1. 192.168.1. That um, Netgear router, it's different since it's a Frontier router. But we aren't with Frontier anymore, so the router is still 192.168.254.254. This one is something else. I don't know how to say it. You either need to change that one to that IP, or you need to change that IP to that IP. How do you do that? Well, these this router is capable of changing it, but this one doesn't have a MAC IP address, so I can't give. I can give this one that one's IP address, but I can't give it the MAC address, so it won't let me do it. Okay, so. How do I do it? Well, you want to get, you want to go to, like, you want to go to Netgear. You want to go to Walmart, buy the same exact router, or it has to be a brand, the same exact brand of router, because all the Netgear routers have the same IP. Makes sense. So, like, if you have TP-Link, TP-Link. Is gonna have that, but the but Netgear modem routers they're gonna have a different IP, so you don't want a modem router and a motor wireless router. You just want two of these same ones. So basically, how do I do it? Well, you go to the Netgear page. You're gonna find wireless settings, and it's gonna tell you. Um, it's gonna tell you guys to um. It's gonna basically show you the oh, thing. You're go you can make it be. I kind of make it be realistic. I have two Wi-Fi networks, so it doesn't automatically like go to that router and then it switches back to like it usually switches in about the living room, in the middle of the living room, or like in the hall, like in on the left side of the living room, the one closest to this hallway down here. I don't like it to do that. So basically, this one's um, Netgear 03, and then that one's Netgear 03 out there, EXT, because it's the extender. This one's not the extender. So yeah, guys, you just want to put it on the same channel. You don't want to do anything with the Mac, or the IP, as long as you got the same router. It's going to work perfectly fine. As long as you guys got the same router IP, it's going to be fine. So I'm pretty good with this. I got all the Wi-Fi signal I need. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys did know, because I've been doing so much research. This is like the small bar they give you. But I've been doing so much research, and you guys are probably being mad, and then you guys finally come to this. But seriously... 
this is like, it's so annoying to me because I go to somebody's page, I try it, it still doesn't work, I unplug all the wires, bring it out there, field to obtain IP address, and all that stuff, but I finally figured it out on myself, and I'm so proud of myself, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you guys finally enjoyed, now if you're in my case, this is, you're gonna be so happy to me, for me, to tune, how do you say it? you're gonna be so happy for me, to me, because like, Thank you guys so much, but, like, please like this video if it helped you, because come back to this video, pause, do all that stuff like I told you to do. Well, but seriously, guys, oh, I got some two Netgear routers sitting out. Go do that real quick. Go to Auto Channel, and then just um, do that. Come back to this video, like it, subscribe if you want to. But, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this helped you. I'll see you guys later. Peace.